This is a WZ-132A. This is a Chinese uh, Tier 9 light tank, and the map is uh, Pilsen. I am going to get uh, 4,000 spotting damage in this game. I'm going to get a mark of excellence, and I am going to take out three of these enemy bad boys. Okay, so you're going to see something really cool. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go over here. You're going to spot any vehicles that cross over here. And then guess what you're going to do? Yeah, you see over there, you can snipe at those vehicles. And then you come over here and look at what you got over here. You got another ambush position, which is the P-44 Pantera, uh, this vehicle that's crossing over. You got a second chance to ambush those vehicles. And then guess what's going to happen? Aren't you glad you watched my channel? You come over here and you ambush the same vehicles a third time. Uh, we got two vehicles that hopped over. Unfortunately, I didn't get a, a chance to take a shot at them. So you got three ambush positions uh, when you play on the northern spawn. From the southern spawn, there's a way to do it too, uh, which I discuss in another. You know, I got to turn the volume down. I can't believe they make it so loud. Uh, where is. I don't know why it does. There's, some, there's a bug in the game where um, it doesn't recall the settings. And it, like, I don't normally play with this little red dot and stuff like that. It's just so loud. Okay, so the SPG, he's never going to hit me again in this position. That's how good I am. I got 333 damage, 203 spotting, and I got hit by that M40. Oh, he thought he could hit me. That was a Skoda T27. He could be an, I, yeah, that is an autoloader. So you gotta, you do got to watch out. Looks like that sneaky MP, SPG hit me. But I got that Skoda for 863 spotting damage. He really uh, took a lot of damage with that. When this happens, you see we've got three of my allies over here. We got snipers over here at least two enemy tanks, I want to go help out my team. If I rush in and spot these guys, uh, my allies are going to be able to take them out easy. So why not go do it? I did get the spotting damage on that Burrask. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to do any damage, but I got a lot of spotting damage. Three, four, five, maybe 700 spotting damage on that Burrask. So I'm up to 1693 spotting damage, and I am going to get 4,000 in this game. So I do want to go in. There's definitely two vehicles over there. Let's see if he survives. He did hit me, but he took 259 damage. And he got hit. Oh, he's almost out of the game. He took 842 spotting damage. Uh, but he did hit me for 242. Fortunately, I wasn't able to go up there. I did make a mistake, uh, which was uh, hitting battle button. Obviously, I should be using the uh, sniper mode. You can see he's out of the game. Uh, he was probably reloading, which is why I took him out of the game. See the amazing climbing ability of the WZ-132A. This is a great tank. I love playing it. I do have a mark of excellence on it now. Oh, look at that. So you want to elevate that gun. I was able to take that vehicle out of the game. Oh, oh actually, he did damage me. He hit me for 207. I did take two enemy vehicles out of the game. I'm up to 955 damage and 3501 spotting damage. And I'm doing it with no hands on the keyboard. Okay, so the RU-251 hit me for 234. Come on. And he's out of the game. I'm up to 4,000 spotting. Oh, please post. Uh, what a horrible job I did this game. You overextended yourself. You, allowed the, you didn't have good situation awareness. Okay, so I got 1,300 damage and uh, 4,000 spotting damage. And I took out three of those bad boys. Score seven to six. Obviously, 
Uh, it's because my allies suck so bad. Ooh, Tegrity Farms. Yeah, I remember this game. I don't know why I'm sitting here. I mean, come on. Scores 9-7. to seven. I don't know what's going on over here. I don't think I can switch to another player. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Who do we got here? This is a standard B. We're going to see amazing gameplay. Watch how quickly he goes in and kills off the enemy team. You can see that he's got that amazing gun. Uh, standard B is an auto reloader, which means that he's always going to have lots of shells. Uh, he's a very fearsome tank. Scores 11 to 8. He's going to take advantage of this uh, three tank advantage over the enemy. You can see that he saw that enemy running away and he reacted immediately to the uh, fleeing standard B. Going after that STRV. STRV is now out of the game. The ML2, the ML2 took him out of the game. So I was reporting in the in-game chat the remaining hit points of uh, some of the enemy vehicles. Uh, he did uh, take out Tegrity Farms. Scores 14 to 8. Look at how quickly he reacts to that remaining vehicle. And instead of using the ram, he goes for the... Ah, uh, you missed it. Okay, so the ML2 beat him to the punch. Um, I don't know. These must be my stats, right? Is that how it works? Yeah, I'm guessing it does. Okay, so that's a game score was 15 to 8, obviously because of me. I believe I got 1,300 damage, 4,000 spawning damage, and I got the mark of excellence on that vehicle, which was a WZ-132A in this game. Okay, so if you have any questions or comments, and I'm sure you do, please post in the comments everything I did wrong. Uh, and don't forget to follow me on Twitch and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I now have a, cha a channel exclusively for light tank gameplay. So if you want to see amazing commentary but crappy games every day, light tanks only, subscribe to my light tank channel.